Well, I wake up at dawn, dawn and I put my mask on. Good job, Red. Red's still collecting. Cat's collecting. Everybody's collecting. Everybody's having a blast right now. Meanwhile, I'm working twice as many hours. They're hoarding the toilet paper. Like they hide it in the freezers and then they yell at us when we go in the freezers trying to look for stuff that we need because we pick orders for online customers for Amazon Prime. And then they're like, get out of the freezer. And we're like, why are you guys being so weird now? And there's like a stash of toilet paper in the freezer. I sound angry. I don't want to sound angry. So I brought a kazoo. They're letting less people in even though the line's not big and they're letting everybody back in at Ralph's. I mean, what is this? Is it like a country club here now? They completely carpet bombed this area with bleach. It smells like ass at the YMCA. They still got the lines on the floor. Social distancing, don't come within six yards of me. Can you jump from that line down to this line? There you go. There you go, very athletic, very good. No, no, you're getting too close. You're out of toilet paper. Who even wants to shop anymore in the aisle that smells of ass? This has nothing to do with the coronavirus, I'm sorry, but why are they calling the chicken feet paws? Makes me think of my cat, like cat feet. Okay, I'm gonna show you where they're hiding the toilet paper in the back. This is like Al Capone's fault. Don't tell anyone. Here's a map, but they're hoarding it. These guys are selling it on the open market. One roll of toilet paper is worth an 89 Ken Griffey Upper Deck Rookie Card. <laughs> I got two toilet papers and a bottle of soap.